Final jump race of the day is a three mile two furlong chase, so Gold Cup draw. Uh, at the top Savage Point, Darren Thompson, Invictus Reigns, and Sue Hyle thinking for Derek Hinton. Farm Week and Von Trapp, John Morgan, emerging name Leon Van Rensburg, Elvis Martin, Lidham, Corbin's Raw, Graham Clutterbuck, Little Rock Kingdom, and San Pedro, Paddy, Vinnie Gerard, winning Brillant, Alex Cherry, Bagel Adira, Oliver. David Robertson, Finding Alice, Martin Lidham, Neve Campbell and Thunder Rosa for Matt Cooper and Daenerys Cry for Graham Clutterbuck. Calling in and away. It's rained all day and it's still raining now as we head towards the first of the fences. 18 of them we've got to take in this. And Neve Campbell right over on the far side is the early leader as they pass the winning post with two complete circuits of this Haydock track ahead of them. And there's three of them that have pulled out from the pack, really. Neve Campbell right over on the far side. And Elvis with a noseband and tucked in just behind them. Farm weak. I think John Morgan's only runners today but in this race. As they take this top turn. It's Neve Campbell for Matt Cooper in the lead. Elvis is in second. And Farm weak, the first of John Morgan's two. Just making it a group of three for the lead. But the one that's trying to... Get to them and bridging the gap between the leading three and the main pack is Derek is uh, John Morgan's other one, Von Trapp. A decent horse in the back end of the 80s, wasn't it? As they get over the first fence when they eventually get to it, they're all over it safely, and Elvis jumped his way into the lead. A short run to the second, which they're all over their one or two nods on landed, including Savage Point on Darren Thompson. But it's Elvis. Leads into the third. And Farm Week and Neve Campbell. Von Trappers now join those three to make it a leading group of four. There's a gap of four or five lengths then to San Pedro Paddy. He's on the outside of Corbin's Raw with winning Berlant after that one. Then the first of the Greys. There's a Suhail thinking as they get over the fourth. All safely over it. Neve Campbell jumped into the lead. Ditch at that time, it was Farm Week who jumped into the lead, and Von Trapp has dropped back off that leading three and is now racing with San Pedro Paddy. So the pace is a little bit too hot or not, I don't know, but it's Farm Week in the lead. John Morgan likes his front runners, so too does Matt Cooper, who's got Neil Campbell, and Elvis was in the lead last season, and when he won his races, he did it from the front. so Maybe the pace is pretty hot. Von Trapp is back in fourth. Then comes San Pedro Paddy. And Corbin's rules after that one. And then William Brillant as they take the sixth. They're all safely over. Invictus Reigns is now just a back marker. And they get to another ditch. They're all safely over that ditch. With Neve Campbell. Farm Week and Elvis virtually three in a line. towards the next. This is fence number eight. And we'll get over that one okay. With Von Trapp back in fourth, then Corbin's Raw and San Pedro Paddy with William Brillant on their outside as they take number nine. And Victor's Reigns a little bit detached from the rest of them towards the back and Derek Hinton's other horse. Sue Hale thinking also struggling at this point but there's still a mile and a half to go and they're going to come past the winning post of the stand big screen in case we've forgotten where we are after that it's farm week neve campbell and elvis and a five length gap to von trapp and idea now of elvis singing the sound of music i'm not quite sure how that'll work anyway corbin's roars after that one then san pedro paddy and winning brillant thunder rosa is next maybe if they get into the league and race against each other and Stu's doing the commentating he'll burst into songs he likes to do that sometimes and maybe he'll do an Elvis Presley version let's say that again an Elvis Presley version of the sound of music or oh, maybe he can do an Elvis Costello one anyway they're over number 10 and Farm Week is the leader from Neve Campbell second and Elvis third and Elvis really gave that one a bit of a wallop Corbin's Raw, Von Trapp and William Brillant are getting closer, then finding Alice 
is after that one and then Ballier do it dearer either as they get to number 12 and suddenly now then Farm Week has started to stretch and has pulled two or three clear of Neve Campbell who's in second after that mistake Elvis is dropping into the pack winning Berlant and Von Trapp have gone past him and Corbin's roar is getting closer then there's a bit of a gap to finding Alice and Balladier at Ivor as they take the 13th the Derek Hinton pair are beginning to tail off Suhail thinking an Invictus reigns as they head down towards the next. This is another ditch and now it's a John Morgan 1-2. Farm Week and Von Trapp from Neve Campbell. It's still there in third. Then winning Bronte and Corbin's roar after that one. Elvis is now beginning to struggle. Balladera Ivory is after that. San Padro Paddy is trying to run on. So too is finding Alice. Little Rock Kingdom is after that one. But it's Farm Week and Von Trapp who are going to swing into the straight in the lead. Being chased now by San Pedro Paddy. Then after that one, Corbin's Roar. Elvis is trying to get back into it. Then comes Little Rock Kingdom and William Brillance after that one. Thunder Rose is the latest one to drop right out the back. But it's Farm Week who takes this fall from home in the lead. From San Pedro Paddy in second. Von Trapp was a faller there on the inside. And Von Trapp's gone. So San Pedro Paddy now takes it up over this final ditch. Better jump though by Farm Week. Farm Week now comes to challenge for the lead. Emerging name has come through from nowhere into third. Then Little Rock Kingdom and Balliador Ivor. They're racing down towards the second last fence in now and it's Farm Week who's in the lead. Farm Week over the second last in front. Jumps it well. Gets away from it well. Then comes San Pedro Paddy. Thunder Rose has gone. Fighting Alice has gone. But it's Farm Week who's now two to three clear over the final fence. Farm Week jumps it nicely in front. Little Rock Kingdom moves into second but it's Farm Week who's clear. Little Rock Kingdom is beginning to close out. He's eating up the ground. Little Rock Kingdom is getting Getting closer, Farm Week, what's he got left? The jockey's asking for one last effort. It's Farm Week who's hanging on. Here comes Little Rock Kingdom. Farm Week holds on. Little Rock Kingdom second. Then emerging name of San Pedro Paddy, Balliador, either Corbin's Rule, and Elvis and Savage Point. And it looked as though the Vinnie Gerard horse was going to reel in the John Morgan horse, but it didn't quite happen, and Farm Week stuck his neck out and took it, so Farm Week takes it for John Morgan, Little Rock Kingdom for Vinnie Gerard second, emerging name, Leon Van Rensburg third, San Pedro Patti for Vinnie Gerard again was fourth, and Balladera Iver for David Robertson was fifth.